Today I'm here to show you about a math manipulative app called Pattern Shapes. Um, this is a great tool to allow students to use for virtual math manipulatives that are right at hand whenever needed. So great resource for them to use to kind of problem solve or create and collaborate as they um, kind of construct their knowledge or solve a problem. So you can see that you kind of start with a blank canvas. To the left you have um, kind of a menu of, of shapes to choose from. As you want a shape you just simply click and pull it out to drag it wherever you would like. This little arrow allows you to rotate it so that you can manipulate the shapes to build whatever you would like. Um, down going across the left hand bar you also have a ton of outlines to choose so they can actually fill it with shapes and see which shapes will evenly complete a pattern. You can also create your own which is really nice. Um, by default you have no grid down here but you can choose a squared or triangular grid. You do see you have a color bar down here so if students wanted to change the colors of their shapes to build um, a picture or just to differentiate them, they absolutely can. You do have two separate sizes to choose from in each shape, which can be used down here. You also have the ability to um, duplicate a shape, so if you, you needed to repeat it, um, you absolutely can. Another feature is a built-in protractor, so if you are having students um, measure the angles of shapes, you can absolutely do that. Um, as needed. You can kind of rotate it. You also have the ability to type in numbers and um, kind of make your number sentences or simply use your pencil to draw or write out um, anything that you would like. So you have a blank canvas um, kind of whiteboard to pull shapes, protractors, patterns, um, as well as write and draw, which is a, a great kind of canvas for students to start with. This is great for a number of things, obviously for um, anything shape related, but also I've seen a lot of great use come from fractions. Um, I've seen teachers use it for flips and turns. I've also seen um, a lot of great use in this app just for the whiteboard alone and, and building the shapes to represent an answer and once you're done you can easily take a quick screen capture and this can be submitted to you or or used as evidence if you need to start over you can simply clean off here or if you make a mistake you can trash can the last mistake so this is pattern shapes I'll show you one last little feature which is this eye icon which kinda gives you a step-by-step -step of what you can do with the app which is really nice as well as um, some extra resources about the app. So check out Pattern Shapes.